Today, the candidates for Dorchester County Sheriff answered a series of questions in front of community members, highlighting some of their expectations they have for the future of the department. Our Caroline Spike shares what they had to say. Our very own Raphael James was the moderator for this debate-like forum, asking candidates Charles Frederick and Sam Richardson the same question with the same amount of time. There were over 50 community members there to see this public Q&A, which lasted about an hour. There's a lot of vague questions that, you know, you're trying to put in perspective in a, in a two or three minute time. So it's, it's, it's difficult to do that, but, you know, we up for the task. Frederick says this was a more community engaging forum compared to the others. There have been three in total leading up to the voting season, and today citizens were able to ask some of their own questions. The majority of those who attended today's forum were wearing a sticker representing Richardson. Good questions. I got a chance to, to um, state my platform, but you know, I got a chance to answer some important issues for our citizens. And the good thing about it is uh, being accountable and transparent, I take a lot of fulfillment in doing that. Some of the community members' questions involved topics like mental health, sex trafficking, women in the agency, funeral escorts, immunity among officers, as well as their budget with technology. Both Richardson and Frederick said they plan to incorporate more technology if they win in November. In their opening statements, Richardson laid out his goals for the position as better technology, more patrol in the streets, as well as keeping violent offenders off the streets. Frederick said his background with the South Carolina Highway Patrol will bring something different to the community if elected as their sheriff. When I came to, to, to the sheriff department, I walked in and they didn't have uniforms. So I'm like, what, what was going on? This is a different philosophy in doing business. And I think I'm the man that can change that. Though both believe they are best fit for the role, Richardson says his current position as chief deputy second in command has prepared him for this. He comes from the higher patrol. Uh, he was a corporal at the higher patrol. He came in, sheriff made him a lieutenant in traffic. He was not involved in any of the strategic plan of the office, the budgetary process, or the jail. So I'm just, I'm just not sure that he'd be an effective uh, sheriff for us. Early voting does open tomorrow, and you can find locations for your county on our web story. Reporting in the newsroom, I'm Caroline Spikes, Live 5 News.